what's up guys um from my headline here you can see asorogo soba as a northern apc governor is allegedly involved in a fatal car accident um okay without wasting much of the time let me quickly give you this report so report from abuja says um Asurok was taking was shaking when news filtered in that one of the most outspoken APC governors was involved in a car accident. It was also said that Asso Rock had to put a call across to Kaduna State Governor El Rufai immediately to verify the news. It was a rumor after all. Okay, so it was a rumor, it was not true. In the past hours, telephone calls from various individuals have jammed Kaduna State in waves as rumors made round that the state governor Elrufai was involved in a fatal car accident in the early hours of Thursday. So the rumor had it that Elrufai drive driver died in the accident while the governor himself sustained serious injury. Okay, so you can see from a tweet from um, a micro blogging site, Twitter, you can see um, the Twitter from El Rufai there. Um, he says, Kaduna update. I woke up after a rare eight hours, about to deep sleep to learn that some biblically driven PDP affiliated fake news platform have declared my driver dead and my humble self in coma. Both claims are false. All right, so it is a, a false news. It's a fake news after all. So I decided to make this news for you to see. Um, if you see such news, it was not true. You see it, you see the title in any blogging or any site, it is not actually true. So El Rufai here, I've taken to his Twitter handle to disclaim that it's a fake news okay um, so you can see someone here said take a video and run some commentary let them know you are still alive you know actually this twitter handle is not um from not the, the state governor himself um that is handling or managing it so this is what the guy here said he says if it is actually false take a video and run some commentary let them know you are still alive why are you not talking about kajuru sleeping for eight hours is an act of irresponsibility a man whose house is on fire does not just rat killings are ongoing in part of your kingdom all right so this guy here says if every five things nothing happened no accident let him take a video of himself because this Twitter handle are managed by some ICT guys, you know what I'm saying, okay? So it may not really be Elrufai himself typing the message. So however, contrary to the rumor, Elrufai is held and hearty and was not involved in any form of accident, okay? So Elrufai special as advisor on media and communication confirmed that the governor is in good health you know tweet on his official handle all right guys so that is the news if you see such updates you ignore it that the governor of Kaduna state is still healthy and hearty okay um you can see a tweet from someone here saying see how empty you sound the quick response you gave to this fake news same should be applied to the safety and protection of life and property in Kujong, it's just as a result of responsibility that a man can go all out to sleep for eight hours. The life of your people should come first. Okay, remember there is an issue trending on the media that um, some part in um, Kaduna State has been attacked. Okay, so a lot of people are criticizing Eurofire here, saying that he's not supposed to sleep for that long for eight hours while his people are under attack all right so um i'm not here to make the news for you guys but just want to share this news for you that wherever you see 
a topic, a title like this, that is a fake news. The governor has taken to his Twitter handle that he is healthy and hearty, that nothing is wrong with him. All right, guys, let's just um, hope it's a fake news because that's what his media on um, ICT said. All right, guys, so that's the news so far. If you have anything to say, put it down in the comment section below. And remember, if you haven't subscribed, support me by clicking on that resubscribe button. I am out. I will see you in the next video.